Hi, my name is Miguel from AvoidErrors.net. In this tutorial, I'll show you how to boot your Windows 7 from a USB device. For this tutorial, you're going to need this Win to Flash program. It's in the link in the description box. When you go to the link, I download it and use this one here, just in case you get confused which one to download. All you need to do once you download it is right click and extract it. I extracted mine here to this folder. And the one we're going to use is this one, win to flashexe Now this program doesn't install on your system, it just runs on your system. Go ahead and double click to start the software. Once in the wizard, it's really simple. All you need to do is just click next. Now, where it says Windows File Path is where you have your disk, your Windows 7 disk, usually it's in Drive D. But just to make sure, just click on Select, Expand My Computer, and here it is on Drive D. Just select it and click OK. And there is my Drive E, so I don't have to go and look for it where it says USB Drive. I know that is E. so just click on next and accept terms and agreement and here this warning is just to let you know that it's gonna delete all the data from the USB so it can become a bootable uh, USB just click OK and now it's making your USB a bootable and this is very good because you don't have to run any command line and you don't have to uh, manually do anything this is done automatically with this program now it's finished and click next all done perfect now all we need to do is install the USB on a netbook and test it. So let's do that. Perfect. I got my netbook which is turned off installing the USB that we just created. And now I'm turning it on and pressing F2 so we can go into the BIOS and let the computer know to start from the USB to boot from the USB now I'm just going to the uh, boot tab here this is really uncomfortable with a camera on my hand and go down where it says USB hard drive Toshiba trans memory and make it the first boot device I apologize that it's moving a lot. It's really uncomfortable doing, you know, holding the camera and now press F10 to to exit and yes to save your BIOS configuration. And as you can see, it worked perfect. Now it's booting from my USB. done all you need to do is press next and just follow the instructions that's it thank you for watching this video my name is Miguel feel free to email me if you have any questions